So yesterday in part one of our hero series, I shared how the greatest leader and hero that you can look up to is in you right now. So today, I'm gonna share the action plan on how to wake up that hero within, if you're interested. I think it's appropriate to start with a quote from the man most remembered for playing maybe the most iconic superhero of all time, and then went on to become an extraordinary hero in his own right, Christopher Reeve. Christopher said, a hero is an ordinary individual who finds the strength to persevere and to endure despite overwhelming obstacles. You see, I'm committed to helping you realize the hero in you, that admirable, powerful, awe-inspiring person you've always wanted to become and have always been capable of becoming, but maybe didn't know how to bridge the gap between your vision of yourself or the attributes that you admire in others and where you are currently. Inside you is that admirable, powerful, awe-inspiring person you've always wanted to become and have always been capable of becoming. So let me help you bridge that gap between where you are and that heroic potential that lay inside you. Step number one, think of your heroes. Who do you admire the most? Who are the most successful people that you can think of? Bring them to mind. Maybe they're people like uh, Oprah Winfrey or Richard Branson, the late Steve Jobs, Warren Buffett, Christopher Reeves, as we talked about, whomever that you see as enviable, admirable, and heroic. Who are your heroes? Maybe it's your mother, maybe your father, previous athletic coaches, a teacher, a former boss, whoever it is for you, just bring them to mind, okay? That's step one. Step two, now, what single words would you use to describe them? Make a long list. Maybe words like, oh, they're, they're passionate, they're committed, they're positive-minded, they're confident, uh, they're driven, perseverant, inspiring, persuasive, empathetic, etc. Once you have exhausted your mind and have a big list, move on to step three. Step three is this, narrow it down to the top 12 most important attributes to you in your heroes. Once you've picked your dozen most important, you will now have a clear picture of your heroic you. You've just described your hero and the hero in you, the one you are capable of becoming. Of course, with some growth, some training, and some development. Many days sitting right here on Darren Daily. Then step four, evaluate your current self on a scale of one to 10, 10 being the highest, and you being the very living epitome of each of those 12 attributes. For instance, you might go down the list and say, Hardworking, okay, I'm a seven there. Consistent, okay, I'm a four there. Confident, okay, I'm a six there. And, you, and, and be honest, choose whatever it is for you. If you are not sure, this is a good exercise anyway, ask your spouse, ask a really good friend, ask your leadership team to rate you on your 12 most important attributes. Everywhere you score yourself less than a 10 is your new personalized personal development plan. It is your hero development plan. Now your entire personal growth and training should be specifically focused on the development of those critical attributes. You described all the heroes that you look up to. We narrowed down and identified the very best and most important attributes of all of them to you. And we've assessed where you are by comparison. We know the exact gap between where you are now and where you need to grow from here to become the hero you are truly capable of becoming. You wouldn't have identified those attributes if you didn't already see it and recognize it in yourself. Now the rest, to become the hero you most admire is in your hands. The difference between knowing and becoming is doing. You have to do what it takes to grow into the superpower of being faster than a speeding bullet, more powerful than any naysayer, and able to leap tall goals in a single bound. So what are some of the hero attributes most important to you that you rate highest in? Declare it out loud and proud by sharing that with us in the comments below.